Good morning everybody, it's Rhea from Maisie Moo here. Real quick one today, I'm going to show you how to put together the Wee Card Cuddler. Now I featured this on Facebook last week, uh, it was Wee Play, I was making one up um, for myself actually because I've got so many cards. I am going to add two designs, this one here that you can see with the um, square end, which is quite a um, simple pattern, they both are quite simple. Uh, this was made using faux leather that has two designs on either side. I got this from um, Jewel Box and I'm pretty sure I've got something similar from Polka Dot as well. So if between the two of them I'm sure you'll find something but um, I'll put a link for this one there. So what this does is it's just one single piece but it gives you that look of two different designs. So today I'm going to do a, a more feminine design. They're both going to come together in the same um, set. Radio. So simply cut out your shape. One shape. I've made this one here um, with, it's quite a cute cactus print. And what I've actually done with this one is I have lined it with HTV. So I've just used my um, Cricut heat press and popped it on before I cut it. And you'll see it comes with all the holes that you need. Now for this um, hardware wise, you're going to need some sleeves. Now the original <laughs> sleeves I put on Facebook sold out so I have got another link there and I understand they've got like a thousand so we should be good uh, otherwise you can get these anywhere and they come with if you have a look there it's like a little hole and that hole lines up to my template now if you don't have that hole you can always punch your own and I'm going to be using these rivets and in the rivet set that you receive you actually get a little hole punch so you could you could easily pop them in there using that so um to assemble all you have to do is put your hardware in it's super easy so I'm going to go for just one sleeve you could double it up if you want to but there's 24 card slots in this um simply get your rivet I might go for silver so I've got these smallest ones here that come in the set they seem to close it off quite snugly okay so like I said you've got your sleeve here and you use your rivets but before we do that what I'm going to do is attach my snaps so this one here is going to be your closure on the front so we'll quickly pop this one on okie dokie and you've got to line it up and squeeze. There we go. Now, the other side that closes over like this, I have provided some flowers. So there's four different flowers you can choose from. I think I might go for this bright one, which is a daisy. Um, and that's just to, you don't have to use the flowers if you don't want to. It's just to give it a little bit of an extra, whoops, way to personalise it. I'm going to close that one off. Okie dokie. Right, and then all we need to do is put your rivets in. So the idea is as you snap them in first and then you need to hammer them. Now my hammer is just over here, so give me a minute. I'm going to take this little tool and all I do is I pop it over the top. I like to stick just a piece of felt or something and then I'm going to hammer it. I'll be two seconds. Okay, so I've hammered those on. They're really snug. If you put um, maybe two sheet, two of these sleeves on, you might want to use a longer one. Um, but that's up to you. And then you simply close it off and put your cards in. So there we go. Two options. Um, as I say, you can make this without the flower if you want to, or this is one of them here, but there are as a, there's, there's four different options, or just go for the plain one. It's up to you. Super easy, super quick, and I reckon these should be quite popular with people. We always have all these extra cards, coffee cards, and... I will have all these petrol cards, so I'm looking forward to see what you make out of them. All right, thanks so much for watching. See you, bye.